Hey everybody, time for the members only bonus video segment. In case you haven't, you'll need to go back and watch the Lake Fork Crappie Show that uh, aired recently on the Southwest Outdoors Report. But here's some more information on how and where we caught the fish that you saw us catch on the show. Now, we launched the boat up at the 515 West Bridge. That's typically where I put in because I usually fish that arm of the lake. Now, most of these crappie that you saw on the show today came from the Birch Creek arm of the lake. It just seems like for years, there's always been a good population in this arm and we're circling it for you right here on a map. All the little coves and creeks that feed into Birch Creek on both shorelines will hold crappie. And again, depending on the time of the year, they'll either be up in the creek or out on the mouth or out in front of the creek. Now we're headed into the hotter summertime months in the next few weeks and months. So what you'll need to do is be fishing deeper. So what I would do if I were coming back to Lake Fork in the next few weeks is I would go to the mouths of any of these little creeks or coves and I would push back out towards say 15 feet of water. The fish that we caught were in about nine or 10 feet of water, but they're gonna progressively go deeper as the temperature and the water surface temp heats up. So I would be pushing back out towards 15 feet of water and ultimately I'd be going out to 20 and even 25 feet of water. What you're going to be wanting to look for is the treetops and the brush tops. Out in front of these creeks you'll find a lot of standing timber. It's everywhere. So what you want to do is just go down through there with your sonar, preferably try to find some of that standing timber that's got some big branches down underneath the surface of the water. Those are key. If you can find some where the limbs have fallen, rotted and fallen off the tree trunk and fallen down on the floor of the lake underneath that stand up tree, those are the places where you can use the crappie rod like we showed you, the Mr. Crappie Slab Shaker rod. Drop that heavy jig straight down, ease it along in those brush tops and that's where the crappie are going to be as we head into the hotter weather months of the season. That same pattern will work all the way up and down, not only Lake Fork, but in lakes all around the region. That's the style of fishing you're going to be doing as we head into the hot weather months. Right in the heat of the summer, you can actually catch a lot of crappie right up in the limbs suspended in those same kinds of trees. They won't be down on the bottom, but you can crank it up, fish them in those branches up about halfway between the surface and the floor of the lake, and that's where those crappie will be during much of the hot weather months. Hey, I hope you enjoyed our show on Lake Fork. Come on out, enjoy some of the great crappie fishing that's available here on Lake Fork. We'll see you on next week's show.